today's HealthCast, a new treatment option for a condition that affects between 40 to 80 percent of women by the age of 50. Dr. Scott Jordan with Broward Health is offering patients a less invasive way to remove uterine fibroids while at the same time keeping the uterus intact. The excessive procedure uses laparoscopic radiofrequency ablation to target the fibroids through three small incisions. Now a new option for patients who don't want to undergo invasive surgery. We uh, use the excessive device to ablate the fibroid with radiofrequency ablation. Uh, all under ultrasound guidance, we see exactly what we're doing. We see exactly the temperature change and we know when uh, the procedure is completed precisely because it's, it's all uh, done with uh, sensors and under direct visualization. Dr. Jordan says patients are typically discharged the same day and back to work within a week. And a new study raises questions about the benefits of colonoscopies. While people who underwent colonoscopies were less likely to develop colon cancer, the exam failed to reduce the risk of death from colon cancer among those diagnosed. The overall death rate was about the same for those who were and were not screened at 0.3%. That's according to the study. The American Cancer Society recommends adults over the age of 45 get screened regularly. And Medicare is considering expanding dental benefits. The program doesn't cover most dental care. Under current law, Medicare will pay only for dental services that are medically necessary to treat another covered medical condition. Officials recently proposed expanding benefits for certain conditions. Any changes could take effect as soon as January.